Hey everybody, Trevor Rice here with another vlog as I am getting ready to go back into work for my lunch break and look who we have here. It's our old friend from the previous vlog who was on the ground yesterday from the time of this vlog. But now he's hanging up here on the wall. He hasn't made it too far. So fast forward to me getting off of work. Somebody's playing peekaboo. Look who it is. It's our friend. He hasn't moved very far. He was like right here earlier. And now he's here. Just hanging out. Looking at the camera. God, they are ugly, aren't they? Another day, and I still don't know if this is a male or female. If anybody's able to tell, let me know if you know if that's a male or female. Uh, but no name to it. It's been, it's been hanging out at my place though for a couple of days, and it really hasn't moved too much. But it's been getting colder at night, so I'm guessing that's why it hasn't moved very much. Another thing I've been noticing that uh, is this the equivalent of a tree losing its hair? I guess that's when the leaves fall. So what is, what happens when the pine cones just drop everywhere, all over the place? Does that mean its nuts are dropping? Is that what that means? I don't know, but these things are scattered all over the place. A couple have been on top of my truck. I've just thrown them off to the side, but they're all over. Right over there, too. Like you'll see a bunch on the ground. They're all over the place. Back at the radio station this afternoon, and Fallon went to go save a butterfly earlier today. And... Well, one of its legs appears to be broken, and it's unable to fly as well. Let me flip the camera around before we show the butterfly. Fallon, where did you uh, where did you say you found this this butterfly at? On the sidewalk in front of the ideal, on the way to Anton. And it just looked lonely and sad. It was in the it was in the parking lot, and it was gonna get squished, and I couldn't let it get squished. And it has been struggling. And you said that the shaking of the wings means it's trying to warm itself up. Mm -hmm. And so she dipped a sucker into the water <laughs> so that it could get some sugar. <laughs> but it's struggling to walk. It can't fly. I can show you its tongue. I don't know if you'll be able to get a good view of it, but if you look to the on the side of its face, the little loop, you can see that. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can see it a little bit. That's that's the tongue, and that's how it was eating earlier. And apparently, and I looked this up online. If you just dip the tongue into the sugar water, it will drink whether it realizes it or not, which is good for it. And the fact that it's crawling up my finger is a good sign, too. Yeah, because how many legs do they have, typically? Six? Four? Or just four? Yeah, I'm not sure what happened to the legs on the other side, but it has been struggling to walk around, let's just say that much. Yeah, its front right leg is... Not functional. Whoa, dude. He tends to face plant. I don't know what the typical life expectancy of a butterfly is anyway. Me either. Isn't it just like a few days? I don't know. I don't even know what kind of butterfly this would be. Monarch. Monarch? Yep. I'm not an experts on bugs well normally I'm terrified of bugs but for some reason this little guy just 
he needed some help. Well, butterflies, generally speaking, are always looked at as friendly anyway. Well, yeah, I think my thing is I don't want them to fly in my face. And I guess because he can't fly, <laughs> he's <laughs> definitely not a threat. <laughs> No, this guy can barely walk, let alone fly. Yeah. A little geriatric butterfly. He is, uh, probably not going to live too long if I had to take a guess. Yeah. He looks beautiful, though. He looks very beautiful. So that was her good, good deed today. <laughs> Saving, do you have a name yet? Mm, I'm thinking Greg, Greg for some reason. Okay, Greg. <laughs> she saved Greg. Greg is known for hopping along, falling over on his side like a drunk. Yeah. And butterfly kisses. <laughs> and giving butterfly kisses. Say hi, Greg. You're going to be famous. YouTube famous. This could be the link to me getting popularity on my YouTube channel. Oh, he waved. Did you see his yeah. little leg? Yeah. <laughs> Poor Greg. Thanks for making an appearance on my channel. So many of you have met Jacob, who's our new part-timer. Uh, started with us a few weeks ago and uh, has been out doing remotes with me. Has run the board a couple of times here at WTTL. And he got turned away today. Got told to take his banana costume off because it broke the school's dress code. Let me flip this camera around and you tell me if you would allow this for picture day. Look at that. A wonderful banana outfit. What did the school tell you? Uh, they told me that they would give me a day of detention if I wore it because of a dress code violation. <laughs> that is awesome. And you go to North Hopkins High School. Mm -hmm. North Hopkins. So, yeah. To North Hopkins High School. Why would you threaten detention for wearing this in a picture? That just seems like a crime in itself. I don't know. It is now Wednesday, September, what, 20th? And we still got our friend up here. I found out that I think this is a female. Don't know what we want to name her, but she's still hanging out. And if she's a female, I gotta watch my head. If you don't know anything about praying mantises, when they mate, the woman eats the dude's head. It's absolutely insane. I would stay single permanently if I were a praying mantis. So that's going to put a wrap on today's vlog as uh, it was uh, insect filled today. Uh, that butterfly that you saw ended up passing away that evening. And I think she's going to... Uh, keep the butterfly and put it in some special casing or something and uh she'll remember i think the name was greg i called it fred at one point but i think it's greg and so uh the the butterfly is going to uh i guess be with fallon and her family forever now i guess it was just adopted that's going to do it for the vlog, though. I will be back with some more. I have plenty of things. The KBA meeting's coming up on Monday, so I'll be going up to an award show. I'll try to vlog a little bit there. I've got a remote Saturday night for the summer concert series, even though I think it's the first official day of fall. Uh, weird how that worked out, but it, it is a thing. And uh, I don't know what else is in store, but I will vlog it, I'm sure, if I'm there to see it. Take care of each other. Be good. And we will see you back here soon. I guess be good to one another is how we usually close this thing. Bye.